Alrighty, welcome back to State of Decay! I haven't played in like 10 days, and I'm really scared as to what's gonna happen to my survivors, which is why we're at the main menu, we're gonna go through the loading screen and hope for the best. Uh, while we're loading, I should probably say that, uh, there was a, there's actually a, an update released for State of Decay, which made a lot of adjustments to quite a few things. I don't have the list with me, so I can't say exactly what was changed, but they made a lot of changes to how long some of the shit takes to actually happen. So, like, a lot of the things that were like, oh, we're gonna take three days before you can get another th of this, or before you can reuse this, they, they changed it down to, like, a few hours so that you can actually continue, you know, and you, you can have fun with the current PlayStation rather than having to have fun with the PlayStation way over in the future. But, with that said, you know, if you have periods of time like this where you're gone for 10 days, I guess it doesn't really matter. <laughs> and I really, really, really hope that um, my survivors are fine. We were really good with the food department, but we weren't good with, like, ammunition at all. We were at zero, <laughs> so... I think I've got something for you. You'll find it on your map. Survived another- okay, so we have 122 food, 43- actually, we're doing pretty fucking- we're doing fantastic! Holy hell! What the? How? We have 13 people still alive? I was thinking that, like, half my guys were gonna be missing. Watchtower, <sighs> this is Charlie 6. We're en route to the carnival, requesting access. What? Hello? Watchtower? Hey, will you assholes stop jerking off and open the damn gates? Come on, god damn it, we're right here on the bridge. How do you not see us? Charlie Six to anyone receiving. Where the hell is everybody? Huh. Okay, we're gonna have to check that out. Let me look at the map. Um Last we left off. It keeps on saying max storage exceeded, which I'm assuming is because of the fact that uh I have to figure out the fucking controls again. Okay. Uh, I'm assuming it is because of the fact that we have a garden. I don't know how much it gets us, but I think it's actually been supporting us pretty great. Let's see. Nine daily rations of food per day. And since we use four daily, we've been making an excess of food. Wow. That is awesome. Now, we definitely used almost all of our construction materials, which blows, but I don't even know how much we had last time so that's all right we're doing good we're doing good we're doing we're good we're doing really fantastic uh so let me go ahead and get into here see if they actually did add what i was hoping mm? no what oh i guess that wasn't the update then one of the updates or at least what i read that might be something that happens in the future was uh sensitivity controls and I was like, yes, I would definitely love to be able to increase my sensitivity because that is something that was aggravating. The fact that it takes so long to turn sometimes uh, when it otherwise should be pretty quick to turn, but oh well. Um, let me look at my inventory. We didn't want to stay as Aiden, but I'm yeah, he's rested up now, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Uh, let's see who we've got. I want to raise up other people, and people keep on screaming at me like, Oh, gum! You need to use other people and level them up! And I'm like, yeah, right. I, yeah, I, I do. <laughs> I do want to do that. It's just a matter of, uh... They end up on missions when I want to use them. Or they're tired, or they're hurt. So let me... Uh, she's missing. Oh, I'm Ashley. Now, people told me, or at least someone said in the comments down below, that people go missing... Oh, jeez. People go missing because of infestation, or a high amount of infestations, so I need to climb up the survey tower and find out where the infestations are. I don't know, like I didn't know that, you know, it's, <laughs> it's a con with being of doing a blind let's play, but yeah. Oh, you know what? I need to increase outpost uh, ranges, because holy hell, <laughs> there you go, <laughs> alright. Oh, I wish this overlapped a little bit. I was hoping this would, but it's okay, whatever. Is someone coming at me? Oh, ooh. Good job, nice shot. Okay. I could, oh no, we don't have the supplies. I was gonna say I could extend the range by uh, using up some ammo, but 
I don't know if I really want to, and I don't know how long this lasts. Hmm. Yeah, you know what? Fuck it. I might as well do some uh, sniping. We have one ammunition due to that one mission where we helped out the other survivors, and they're like, yeah, okay. So there we go. Now we'll extend our range, and that, let's see what we've got everywhere else. Do we have anything? That's not it. I'm trying to see if we have any actions that will allow us to uh, trade with anybody else. Oh, wow. Did I not park this? That sucks. All right. I'm headed out. Okay. Watch yourself out there. You're going to have to excuse me. I'm a little bit loopy. I haven't recorded in like a week, so I have to up myself up back to what? What's my proper mind? Holy Jesus Christ, what the fuck? There's, a, there's like 15 zombies in that goddamn food area. It's like, oh, we have a 50%, we have a fucking 50% sale off on brains. Except it's Bronto gas, so it's not even a restaurant. It's a fucking gas station. Whatever. Snipe the zombies while I distract them. This is a good plan, actually. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Hi, right, how's it going? Bam. I've got a wrench. It does well. Dead end just landed on top of the zombie, which is kind of very amusing. Can I get on top of these cars? Not really. Okay. Jesus. When they die to a sniper bullet, it's really insane. But, you know what? It's whatever. I don't know. I, I Is he actually using ammunition? That's, su that's something I don't actually know anything about. Oh, jeez. What is up with all the zombies around this area? All right, fuck it. We got to go to the... um. Oh, wait. Let me first park that modern pickup in a better position. Because there's an old pickup here that I don't really care about. So we're just gonna go. Oh, hey, yeah, look at that. That little running spree let me level up my cardio, which is fantastic. Uh, is he leveled up completely in, in anything he can get? Let me see. Yeah, looks like it. All right, let me park this fantastic little thing. I don't know why we keep on getting missions that are all like, oh, help us take out the armored zombie, and you can't do anything until... <laughs> you can't do anything with those people until after you help them. It's really aggravating. There is supposed to be a sand... Survivors they're supposedly making a sandbox. Uh, what is this? Should contact us on this frequency. We'll make every effort to get you an escort. Speaking of frequencies, have we... Still don't have any other channels. Might never get out of the channels, but oh well. Uh, construction device, medical advice. Oh, man. Yeah, no, a lot of these are going to be patched up soon enough. I don't know when the patch is going to be coming, but a lot of those are going to be changed, so it's like three hours rather than, you know, a week. Or, oh, like, like, feasts. You're so good at surviving out there. Eh? It might be a good idea if you train some of the rest of us. Teach Jacob a trick or two? Say what? I want to do that. Yeah, hold up, hold up, hold up. What am, I don't even know where I'm going. I'm just kind of like... I have to put myself in the proper mindset. Because I was in a really good mindset when we were ending off State of Decay about 10 days. Did he just kill two people once? Or did I run over one while he shot the other? I don't know. But either way, badass. Anyways, um... I was in a, I was in a really great mindset about a week ago when I was last playing the state of chaos I was like all right we gotta do this we gotta do that in order to make us live and we got to keep on gathering all these supplies yeah and then I took a nap and played the last of us when I woke up yeah that that worked out really great but it's okay once I get back into the mindset of surviving in state of decay everything will be happy hunky dory and we'll have our three parts a day hopefully all right so let me go ahead and climb up this tower and see if I can spot any infestations. Um, hopefully, <laughs> hopefully I will be able to because I want to clear them out and make sure that, you know, there isn't any infestation like right next to our place. That, uh, someone said that there was a glitch that was preventing houses from being identified with infestations, which sounds interesting because, you know, in the thought process, it does sound like it would be like a legitimate thing to not be able to immediately know where the infestations are. But we do see sometimes that infestations just kind of pop up on the map. So I'm not, I'm not really sure what does what, but let's just climb up this tower and figure out what we've got going on. And then train Jacob. And then 
swap over to someone else and be like, all right, look at all these things we've got going on. I'm there. I'll take a look around. There's a freak. Juggernaut, a freak. Screamer. I wish he would actually say what it was. Rather than just being like, there's a freak. Oh, that's a lot of zombies. Or, he's, you know, it's, a, it's not even. It's like, what, seven zombies? We can fucking handle that shit. So is that it? No, like, infestations popping up on, on, on here? Nothing? Alright, so I might not be able either there are no infestations around here. Or what the hell? Oh, that's a waterfall. Um you know someone asked if I could go up there? No. <laughs> there's like I don't think there's any way for me to get up to those those windmills. But uh So by the looks of it, either there are no infestations around us at the moment in the very wide area, or there's you know, we have to actually find them on the ground, which I'm not too happy about. It'd be nice if my guys could actually search for it themselves and be like, Oh shit, I just saw a house with like 20 zombies in that. Uh, I think we should do something about it. I'd be like, yeah, you're right, we should. But, oh well, let's go ahead and get to Jacob. Where's my car? My car's over there in the street. God, alright, right? Jesus, I don't even know where I'm parking my cars. Ooh, uh-oh. Wait, a horde's about to blow up. Wait for it. Wait for it. And there we go. That is so worth it. Oh, my God. I don't know how we have so many, like, my... It, 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 I'm glad it doesn't tear into your supplies. Like, this whole, like, oh, the trap shit. Every time a horde wanders into it, it just goes, Oh, hey, we killed a horde. All right, preparing traps again. And that's awesome. Although it is a little bit overpowered, it's like, for an entire day, you have this giant ass kill any horde that walks into it radius. Alright. I'm not complaining, but it is a little bit, uh, fishy. Okay, let me just go ahead and, um, get to Jacob. Did I leave this door open? I don't know. If you ever see me leave doors open at the base, it's usually because I assume they're gonna close by themselves, which they do. Hey, I got a favor to ask you. Could you stop by the store when you get a chance? Yeah, sure, Quentin. But I first have to ask Jacob a question. Hello, Jacob. Well? I'm going to teach you a few things about killing Zeds. Let's go somewhere else. No point in drawing more of them here. Lead the way. All right, cool. Where are we going? We are going a little bit down the street. <laughs> All right. I guess that's one way to do it. Come with me, Jacob. We must kill the zombies. And we're going to run the entire way. You have to work your legs off because you don't really do much. And you know what? You might end up being in charge one day. All right, Jacob. What's up? We got zombie activity three o'clock. Oh, zombie activity at three o'clock. Yeah, yeah. You could just say to our left. All right. Wait. Three o'clock is to the right. Oh, okay. Well, there are a lot of zombies to the right. Is that a bloater? I didn't actually read. I, I saw the juggernaut, but I didn't acknowledge what the other one was. Jesus. Well, whenever these traps are done, that horde's gonna die. But Jesus. Okay, let's just watch the zombie horde die. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait, wait, I also need to crouch. How do I crouch? That's not it. Hey! Are the zombies gonna go for it? Because that'd be awesome. Oh shit. Oh shit. Wait. A zombie horde's one zombie? Oh, no. There's a lot of zombies behind him. Ah! Okay. Petrol bomb out! Yeah! Woo! Jesus! That is terrifying! There we go! And he's killed! Fantastic! Ooh, we're a zombie horde! We're gonna kill you! Not on my watch, buddy! Okay, Hi. now we're gonna go kill some zombies the old-fashioned way. AKA okay, the only ways! Uh, which is pretty much everything you can do. I mean, it, I, I like how there isn't really, like... You either beat the living shit out of the zombies, Let me go find some more. or do something against their head. Too much attention. Sneak to the next location. Fuck. Okay. <laughs> Now's a good time to figure out how to crouch. There we go. All right. I forgot it was holding B, because I you saw me press B, and I was like, oh, I guess that's not it, and I forgot that it's a multifunction button, which is really awkward, uh, if you think about it. But oh well. Stick to the next- it's all the way over there! Fuck that shit, I'm walking. And then I'll crouch as I get close to it. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Did I silence this? No, fuck it, I keep forgetting the silencer. It's- it, it's- it's a human mistake. 
Is this? Oh, a cone. It's a human mistake, though. I'm sorry. It's not intentional. I just keep on forgetting about it. And I'm sure most of you would too. It's like, oh, I'm gonna. I should go back and do that. Oh, Jacob wants help. Oh, I guess I could do that. Wait. Oh, fuck! I forgot my silencer. It's okay. Whatever. If I need to shoot the guns, I'm in a situation that I'm getting fucked over in anyways, usually. Alright, can I go through here? Now uh -huh. let's try some shooting. If nice. you have one, attach a suppressor to muffle the sound. These things are homemade, so they don't last forever. Nothing worse than trying to take a shot with an empty magazine. I'm just legitimately trying to give him combat training. But I don't have a silencer, so part of this is kind of pointless. Is that it? There wasn't even a zombie in here. Seriously? Where's Jacob? Jacob? Buddy? What? Jacob's a ninja. <laughs> a ninja trying to learn new ways. That way he can incorporate everything. Jesus. Alright, let me just search and not rush search. Because rushing my searching is always just gonna fuck me over unless I am in a rush. And I'm not in a rush, so fuck that shit. You've impressed a lot of people around here. So, you know, if you wanted to claim dibs on some of the better gear, I don't think anybody'd mind. Ah, well, you know, I might be a really charismatic leader, even better than Marcus, but I'm not going to start taking every single gear that I don't need. I'll just take what I need, and that's it. Well, maybe a little bit of what I don't need. You know, it's like, oh yeah, I'll just take like five petrol bombs. Usually I don't. Ooh. Interesting. Paul is sad. No, oh, no, not Paul. Anybody but Paul. Paul was a beacon of hope. I found some supplies. Send runners for pickup. They'll be on their way soon. Why do I have to be so loud with that? Thinking about it. It's just like, I found some supplies. Send runners for pickup. You know, in a world where we're supposed to be a little bit quieter. There's the, like, you should just pick up the, mi the, the mic, the walkie-talkie, and just be like, Hey, I found some supplies. Okay, good. You know, it's just, just you know, it doesn't even, it doesn't even have to be like a full-on conversation. Just be like, I found some supplies. I wouldn't be calling for saying that I found some supplies if I didn't want people to come over and pick it up, right? So, yeah. Now I'm not picking up some of these items that I don't need because I figure, uh, because I got yelled at for having people search an area already. I'm gonna assume that I don't need to take these. I took the firecrackers just in case one of the zombies outside fucking came in. I'd be like, alright, here, have some firecrackers. Uh, but I'm not taking some of these these basic supplies so that way the person who I sent for will gather them instead. At least that's what I'm assuming he'll do. And if not, oh well. All quiet here. Sweet, good, alright. With that said, I am gonna go grab that other material and take it back, but, you know, for now I'm just taking, I'm just, I'm just seeing what I can get here. Alright. And what is in this little tiny case? Energy drinks. A lot of them. Damn. Okay, I don't need them. Alright. What little thing am I missing? This drawer. Okay. Let's hope for the best. Oh shit, there's a fucking zombie horde. Oh. Alright. I'm gonna crouch. Now, did I loot everything here? Nope. Damn. We begin the quest to find the last of the supplies. Oh, there it is. Okay. Just gotta make sure I don't make too much noise. 